So this is a trick I like to call St. Louis. It's very neat. Uh, in this deck, I have a card that's different from all the rest. So let's find it. There it is right there. That's right. It's a Garbage Pail Kid. Now, besides the Garbage Pail Kid, something from my childhood that's really weird, uh, we need a regular card selected. So let's go ahead and ripple through. And let's take, in this case, the Ten of Spades. All right, so being a magician, I work on lots of different moves to manipulate the cards. And one of my favorites that I love to work on is called the Invisible Palm. Now, a regular palm looks like that. But when I do the Invisible Palm, it should look like that. So it really is there in the palm of my hand. So I could take, let's say, the Five of Diamonds, and I have that Ten of Spades and Invisible Palm. All I have to do is rub a little, and I can put it right there on top of the Five of Diamonds. Now there's more that you can do with the Invisible Palm instead of just laying it on top of cards. So if I wanted, I could get that Ten right in the Invisible Palm, and I could take it, I could lay it right there underneath garbage pail kid. So now, let's say I get the card right back into Invisible Palm. Now the hardest part is putting it back into the middle of the deck. And that's a lot of good stuff with the Invisible Palm. Now, you can do even more than uh, the Invisible Palm. I have one I've worked on. It's called the, the Pressure Palm. Okay. Now, this one is where you take two cards and you press it just right. And you can fuse the two cards together. And that, my friends, St. Louis.